2020, former Governor Andrew Cuomo set several zero emissions goals for the state. Goals that included Rochester Regional Transportation Authority. Liam Healy checked in with RTS for an update on their progress. Green energy and alternative fuels are one of the ways people are keeping up with the Joneses these days. And it's not just your neighbors. The Rochester Regional Transportation Authority recently received a $5 million grant from Governor Hochul to purchase several hydrogen fuel cell buses. For a breakdown of how the grant is going to be spent, we turn to Tom Breed. Two 40 foot full size buses, which are the buses you see out on the road every day. Five vans, so smaller vehicles similar to what we use for our on demand service now, uh, as well as a mobile fueling station that will allow us to fuel the buses with the hydrogen itself. These new hydrogen buses will complement the 10 electric buses already in service, along with the 10 new electric buses sent to enter service by the end of this year. As of now, RTS is making big strides towards hitting the goals laid out in 2020's State of the State address. 25% zero emission by 2025, 100% zero emission by 2035. By the end of the year, 10% of the RTS fleet will run at zero emissions, just shy of halfway to the goal set for 2025. Breed is also interested to see how the new hydrogen buses do, but he does believe they could be a good solution to some of the issues the electric buses face, like battery capacity during the cold winter and the time it takes to recharge batteries. Between three to five hours to charge an electric bus by plugging it in with electricity, or having a hydrogen tank and filling a hydrogen fuel cell bus in a matter of minutes. The hydrogen fuel cell buses are expected to arrive as early as the end of 2023. Until then, Breed says they'll be focusing on making sure they're ready with the infrastructure they need to hit the ground running. Reporting in Rochester, Liam Healy, News 8.